Welcome to this training video for Low Frame Rate Monitor. Low Frame Rate Monitor is a web application that allows you to monitor any video source in, from your TriCaster or VMC1 system in a web browser. Now it's called Low Frame Rate Monitor because it does not display video at 30 frames a second, but it can be used to even view uh, video sources uh, on low bandwidth uh, connections, potentially even over the internet, as long as you have access to the IP address of the TriCaster system. Let's take a look at how this application works. So first, you need to download and install the software, which you can do by clicking this button on the uh, web interface. The software that downloads, bring it to your TriCaster system, install it, and then uh, once it's installed, we just need to type the appropriate URL to access it uh, through a web browser. Now, if you don't know what to type in here, the first thing we need is the IP address of our system, which we can get by going to our TriCaster, uh, clicking the globe icon, and at the top of the window that appears will be the IP address, 192.168.1.136. So now that we have that information, we can go back to our web browser and type that in, 192.168.1.136, and then you're going to type slash monitor. And when you hit enter, it's going to open up the application, and here, uh, by default, you're going to see output one displayed. But you can change it to any other source or output just by clicking this drop-down list. You can see my different outputs, different inputs, DDRs, uh, still store players, whatever is available on the system. So, for example, if I just wanted to monitor the raw input one, which would be me on the green screen, you can see here it is. And uh, let's put it back in output, though. Uh, you can also change some parameters by clicking the gear in the corner. So by default, the resolution of the interface of the video window in here will scale to the size of your browser window, but you can force it to particular sizes if you want. And then you can also change the, uh, the refresh speed. Now by default, it just goes at two frames per second, but you can see there's other choices in here. So based upon the speed of your connection, uh, you can speed that up or slow it down. So you can see at eight frames per second, it's, it's not too bad. And latency uh, of the window is fairly low, so you get a pretty good idea of what's happening in real time. It's just not at full frame rate in here. Uh, so you can see now that we have it, uh, and I can resize it, and the window resizes. So that's uh, how low frame rate monitor works. Uh, I hope you find this application useful, and thank you.